Did you get lots of nicknames, name calling and stuff? Uh, yeah, not about my height. I, <laughs> it was a weird nickname culture at our school, but not my height, no. What was your nickname? I do a lot about this in my uh, stand-up show, oh, nicknames, yeah. because in, in my... Um, in, uh, our year at school was obsessed by nicknames, to the extent that everyone had about 13. And all of the nicknames had no reason for them. I think a good nickname should have no basis. Like, I, I did have a lot of, you know, tall boy and, uh, and freak and things like that, uh, <laughs> height-related. But the one that I got called most was Fitter. That was my nickname, because they said I was an epileptic, right? <laughs> I wasn't, Graham. I had mild asthma. <laughs> <laughs> that was the culture in our school of just... Uh, uh, but touring around the country, I've realised that uh, we weren't alone, you know? Everybody, so many schools around the United Kingdom had nicknames that didn't really have a foundation in fact. It's been incredible. Do you, you have a nickname? Oh, I had loads when I was younger, cos I used to have red hair, my hair's, hair's gone darker as I've grown older, so all the Duracell and ginger nut and stuff like that. Yeah. And then... Uh, ceramic, somebody called me once. I thought, what are you to ceramic? He thought my name was Blumenthal. <laughs> <laughs> and, then, and then, just before, just before coming on here in the green room, having a chat, and someone was there saying, did you have a nickname? And one of the friends has got a friend with me, she said, oh, yes, uh, so and so is another chef friend of mine. Apparently, I'm now called Cheston. Cheston? Cheston. Cheston. That's, that's been a nickname going on behind my back, apparently. Why? Uh, so my chest is... Big. It's not big. <laughs> I, mean, I just do, do a bit of... Working out and stuff, so oh. yeah, just uh, a little bit of working out. Uh, just yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> looks like all three of us do. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going to say you had a third nipple or something. Like well, <laughs> we um, we asked the audience if they had any nicknames, and we did get a few in. Uh, Ari, Ari Olafson, Ari, Ari. You, 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 and now uh, your nickname was? First off, the name Ari, it's Icelandic, so I'm familiar with Skater. Uh, <laughs> I thought I saw something. Do you like it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I do. We all like it. <laughs> that explains a lot. Hey, break it up, you two! <laughs> Your nickname? Your nickname was? Right, yeah, I, uh, I feel quite ridiculous saying this now that I've actually seen the man, but uh, a few years back, some people in Iceland actually started calling me Ashton because they thought I looked like him. <laughs> uh, it's spit an image, bud. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, Graham, he has makeup on. <laughs> I do. Um, yeah. <laughs> rebuttal! Rebuttal! I have a rebuttal! I have a rebuttal! <laughs> I would like you to know, and I will let the world know, you can come inspect if you would like, I refuse to wear makeup on talk shows. I never do, never, not once, have I ever. And you can come look if you want, good sir. That's all of me, baby. Beautiful.